Hello, my name is Julie. You are watching Treasures Made From Yarn. Um, this is the video I normally do my work in progress video. If you've seen any of my community posts, you will know that uh, my husband had knee surgery and that went okay. He is doing well, still in the hospital as of this recording. So it is kind of, I just got home from, I, was, I spent the whole day at the hospital and I just got home so I might rec so but I am now late Tuesday night recording my work in progress video here are a couple of ones I have finished if you see my tutorial I did a tutorial on this cable bracelet it was gonna have a button on it but somewhere down the ride I thought hey it looked better without the button so that is that. I also finished up a fidget donut. I did a tutorial on how to make this. So I hope you check that tutorial out. I also did an impromptu. This is a gift bag that I did. There's no pattern. I was just kind of winging this kind of messed up a little bit. I had an odd number of these on here and it doesn't look quite even. I think I might change. I did it in continuous rounds. And that we were picking up the rows. Not sure how I feel about that. So this could be a future pattern down the road. So I will keep working on some gift bags. My final finished project is this bag of hat. That's a bag of day pattern. Mad Mimi's Crochet and Farming has a bod, I can't say it, palooza, bod palooza. Well, I, pretty much it's a bod hat every week. I have been kind of been falling out of it for the last several weeks. And I decided to pick one up for this, make one for this week. So that is it for my finished projects. Now we look at some of my work in progress stuff. This one's cute. This is going to be kind of like a reversible doll. I got that. You can flip it over. <laughs> it's got a sad face. My ideal yet is still to make a kind of a hat, probably a flower hat for these and maybe some arms. But yeah, this is mostly done. That's going to be cute. Oh, there it is. I still have, I haven't done much progress. This is still going to be the basket. I haven't got the bottom done yet. I'm not sure if I like how, hey, how my bottom's looking, but. I mean, not much progress on this. Okay, not much, but I got some progress done. A few more rows. This is this is the pattern. This is ah oh, the pattern. Oh man, I'm tired. I'm tired <laughs> being at the hospital all day. But this is the project for Mystery Yarn Challenge 423, hosted by Armchair Chef. I got a little bit more progress on this. I was contemplating bringing this one to the hospital. I probably would have gotten this one almost done. So that is that. All right. Finally, this project is practically for the first time in like weeks. This, for the most part, up to date. This is my April. Temperature blanket, knitted temperature blanket. I don't know if we can get it all. It is pretty much almost caught up. I don't know if you can see, I think I'm still kind of doing it where I'm not doing the whole pattern for the row. I'm just doing sections of it and you can see mostly garter, especially if the pattern's a little more complicated 
or like this one, or like these two days, where it was like 20, 16 rows instead of like two or four, which is probably why I caught up in a hurry because the last couple of rows have only been, days have been only been two rows and a couple in four rows. And the one if I, I'm recording this on the 25th, that's only going to be four more rows. So I'm hoping to stay pretty much caught up on this. And I'm caught up. Here is the crochet one. All that is is a linen stitch. But yeah, a lot of changes in colors. That's what the weather is like in Nebraska, usually in the spring and fall. A continuous change in colors, changes in temperatures. But I think uh, looking at the forecast, it's going to stay 50s, 60s for a while. We will see. But that's that. And I thought I would leave my final project is the one that I've been working on all day. It is my waiting project, which is the shawl. So give me a second. Yeah, I actually finished up one ball and I'm on the second ball. So yeah. Look at that. All day at the hospital. Got, I think I was, when I last left you off, I might have been here. I think I've got only this part done. Now I'm like, finished up, I finished up the one ball. About. Yeah, finished up the one ball and started the second one. It just so happens that the color that the first ball left off happens to be the same one that this next one started. So I got lucky on that one. Yeah. That was surprising how much one ball made. One ball almost actually, one ball actually almost makes, almost make the entire shawl. So. So yeah, went from practically only, like, amazing when you spend a whole day on a project, how much progress you can make. So yeah, so I'll probably, he's still in the, my husband's still in the hospital yet. So I'll see him tomorrow. And if they don't release him tomorrow, I'll work on more of this tomorrow. And then soon he'll start physical therapy. So I'll have to be taking him to his physical therapy appointments. And I'll work on this during physical therapy. So soon this project might actually be done. And if anything, he's going to have his second knee done in about six weeks or so. For sure. This ain't finished. I've, this should be finished. You know, I probably should have a new waiting project by then. But that was it. That was everything. And it's getting, I'm recording this probably about ready to go to bed for the night. And you should, this video should be out sometime Wednesday. So if you did like this video, please give it a like. If you want to see more content like this, please subscribe to my channel. And I want to thank you for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye now.